It's all good. Change from a common thief to up close and personal with Robin Leach. And I'm far from cheap. I smoke skunk with my peeps all day. Spread love, it's the Brooklyn way. The Moet and Alize keep me pissy. Good morning. What did you, you do this weekend, Jacob? This weekend, I did some incredible winged eyeliner on my younger cousin, and it was on point. Is that some, uh, <laughs> some euphemism? No. <laughs> And how was your weekend, Charlotte? It was good. It was lovely. No, 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 waste man. Waste man. <laughs> Act like a waste man. That's not me. <laughs> Act like a waste man. That's not me, no, no, that's not me. Yeah, there we are. That's, that's not me. I also spent the weekend trying out the Amazon Echo, which I bought this weekend, which is great fun. I spent about three hours on Sunday afternoon shouting different commands at it to see what it does. Is that um, really part of your Black Friday binge? Uh, a little bit, actually. It wasn't meant to be, it was a gift. Going into our team meeting for nine o'clock, which is in two minutes, I so we can, yep, yeah, cup of teas, cup of coffees, and then we will all reconvene in the boardroom. Okay. Join us there. Packing gats and stuff now, honeys play me close like butter play toast. From the Mississippi down to the East Coast, condos the Queens, in dough for weeks. Sold out seats to hear Biggie Small speak. Living life without fear, putting five carrots in my baby girl ear. Lunches, lunches, interviews. Good morning on this fine, crisp morning of coming up to the last day of uh, November. This month has been insane. We kind of came across lots of different ways to restructure the company in a way to because we built, we know how to build a quarter of a million pound, we know how to build 300, 400, 500 thousand pound companies, but what we're now learning to do is to build a million pound, two million pound, three million pound, four million pound, ten million pound company. And some of the structuring tools you've got to put in place in order to be able to um, do that is quite quite big and, and a lot different to what we're usually uh, used to. We've taken outside help with that, taken outside, it's fucking freezing. Really cold. Um, we've taken a bit of outside help with that, um, with our coach, and we're working on our 531 to sort of develop us into the goals we want to be in. Our goals are very, very vast, so uh, yeah, I really want to share them with you. So we'll do a bit of a goal setting session and show them, show you guys what our goals are, um, so that you can keep us accountable, which is very, very important. You've surprised me. <laughs> Josh, look, found we've done really well today actually, so we've got like, the, the, that's done, Savage. the proposal's done, the logo's done. The it's second not the done, proposal's Josh. Done. Josh. My Confidence! My proposal's it's not done. done, you can't just say Your proposal's like done. Crazy. I'm impressed I've done it on pages, pages though. I'm very impressed easy, with your pages skills. Word, show them, show them. Challenge. Bring over the camera on. Okay, let me focus. Really. So what this is, is a campaign walkthrough for all of our clients that um, were struggling to get to grips with how to deal with everything that we, we were sending them. So um, it gives them a complete overview of how and what to do. And it includes handy screenshots okay. highlighting, of Josh, highlighting the Each specific section. areas and <laughs> steps, a visual representation of the instructions so they know what they're looking for. Stop it. <laughs> 531 plan is a five year, a three year, and a one year plan for yourself, for your business, for your life. Um, the aim of the game is that you start with your five year goals, and then once you set your five year goals, you come back and you start on one. So you do one, two, three, four, five, all the way up to that five year goal, um, so that you know exactly the steps that you need to take each year to get to that point. Lucy's got some pretty hefty goals, don't you, Lucy? Yeah. Pretty hefty ones. Now I'm going to do Charlotte's, because Charlotte doesn't have a shirt. Some may say. The first four, the first the four sections they stay for like <coughs> outrageously phenomenal. Insanely phenomenal. outrageously phenomenal. Phenomenally outrageous. <laughs> Interesting. Moving um, forward. Okay, hey, what's your fun fact of the day? Okay, fun fact of the day. Post it notes. You should write handy. If you don't pull them up like this, it curls the edges and they fall off things. If you pull it downwards. Okay, that kind of went wrong. Pull it downwards, stays flat, and it won't curl off things. Much flatter than this horrible one. That's amazing. Wait, so that's the one that you pulled off, but it didn't support pulled off one, and this that one's the curled. We invested. In a 50 mil, a meter, cannon, 
lens. Woo, I'm spinning. Yeah. Well, I'm not spinning, I'm just sat here the whole time. Oh. Oh. <laughs> This is no idea we're looking at. <laughs> so cool. This is back! Yay! Charlotte, I've had the coolest morning. Really? Have you not seen the video on the um, Avalanche page? No, I've been working so really hard. This, you know, you like those headphones you put on and it puts you into like a virtual reality yeah and we tried them on <gasps> and we were like we went on google earth and mm. we were like i was in new york and london that's amazing it's incredible oh, that's josh how was your morning it's awesome it was awesome wasn't it? we had good fun good fun that's what, what we like also made good relationships and we hung out with some one of our really really cool clients which was which was really good brilliant it was very productive what have you been doing charlotte What's up, team? Wow, cats! Get your heads again. Hi, Ben. Hey, chaps. How's it going? It's good. First How's time I've been here in business hours. It's like a hub of activity. It's lovely. It is, yeah. It's a lot different to when you first came. Yeah, it is. It's cool. Yeah. It's, it's pretty nice. I like Donald Trump here as well. That's cool. Yeah. It's actually really warm in here. That was me. <laughs> you ready? Tip of the tongue. Teeth in the Tip lips. of the tongue. <laughs> <laughs> so, we have Ben here today who's visiting the office. And, Ben, who do you work for? Uh, well, technically I work for myself, but I work with a double glazing company called the Panoramic Door Company. And what do they do? They sell and install uh, fairly high quality sort of upper market um, aluminium windows, bifold doors, things like that. Any, anything you put glass in basically. Cool. Be creative because we need She wants to edit. Well. No, she doesn't want to edit. Because that's my area. Yes, we know. <laughs> you're okay, you're safe. <laughs> Have get oh, better, shit. get better or you're sacked. <laughs> Inspirational yeah. thing of the day. <laughs> yeah. It's really difficult. Yeah. If you think life is difficult at the moment or work or business is hard, just remember, a plane takes off easier heading into the wind than going with the wind. That's it. That's Lucy, it. have you got the Friday feeling? Yeah. <laughs> How's your first week of uh, juice diet think? Good. Not, um, it's a soup today. How, how, how much weight have you lost? Um, four pounds? Five pounds? No, I've pretty good one week, though. Yeah, but I've starved myself. Do you feel leaner? No. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> you lost five pounds, that's fantastic. Yeah, but that's fantastic. You feel like you've got no energy. <laughs> yeah, I do, yes. I, I read one line of my content 20 times, because I'm so, like, drained. <laughs> I couldn't give them... Right, bye, Ben. Thanks for coming to the office. Au revoir, good to see you all again. Wait. Successful interview. Yeah, no, it was good. It was it was interesting. Yeah. I do think that we I think I need to we need to build the business to be able to to be able to um like headhunt people. Yeah. And like to be able to actually go and find people and like pick the exact role instead of saying to someone, you know, can you do this, can you do that, can you do that? Okay, you're hired. Because I think that's where we're at at the moment. It's also got really in a place where there's yeah. that many professional people, so it's just a matter of time. Bobby. That was scary. Is <laughs> no one can see the distance. So it's Saturday. Um, I'm in the office on my own, doing some. Oh, I haven't got my keys doing some on the business stuff, actually doing the marketing plan um, for 2017 for both Avalanche and for Iga. Um, we promised our coach that we'd get it done before, the everything done before Christmas, and these things are like easily 30, 40 pages long each. Um, so we've let ourselves in for something quite mental. Um, so, but I'm sure we'll get it done. Um, I've already started most of it, I've already got through quite a lot of um, January and February so once we've got to sort of April we can then start to replicate things because basically then it's just a doubling of budgets so the first the real key times um, so yeah actually last night we went to a networking event that's why we weren't here to close down um, went to a networking event for young professionals which I really enjoyed because there's not that much available for young business people young entrepreneurs young you know 
employees that can get together and just hang out in a non-formal, non, you know, here's my business card, here's my business card, here's my business, business card sort of atmosphere. I'm not really a massive fan of those sort of things, where those really regulated networking events, I'm not really, I don't really like them, that's just my opinion. Um, I really enjoy though informal chats where you can hang out with people that are of doing similar things to you. So more of that needs to happen. So we're going to actually, if they, those guys don't, don't do any more, or we really hope they do, um, we're probably going to start doing something here for young people and young entrepreneurs. So if you're in the Whitney and West Oxfordshire, or even the Oxfordshire, Wiltshire areas, and you want to come hang out, just watch out for something, because we're going to be posting it on this channel, um, and we'll post it and get you guys down here for some, for some wines and beer, and uh, some networking, so that'll be really, really good fun. Yeah, what my dream is to have that, I want that whole thing. That whole office space there. In fact, we're just going to take the whole, we're just going to take all of this offices, all of those offices, all of that, all of that, and all of that, and make it some mad campus for Avalanche and Iger. Should be awesome. So that's actually the new company that's moved upstairs into that whole floor upstairs. There, uh, I don't actually know what they do, I think it's something to do with the shipping. This is now we fixed as well, look, look how cute it is. But yeah. Stereotypes of a black male misunderstood. And it's still all good.